We're getting level 5 autonomy. This year? Welcome back to Interest Things. My name is Jack O'Brien. Elon Musk has said that Tesla will be having vehicles with level 5 autonomy available this year, and this will be due to many upgrades to the Tesla model. These upgrades will include things such as 8 cameras, 12 ultrasonic sensors, and 40 times more processing power. Tesla is basically making their car a beast, and autonomous vehicles are the one thing where having Donald Trump in office might actually be a good thing. Elaine Chao is the head of the Department of Transportation and welcomes autonomous vehicles with open arms. Companies such as Uber, Lyft, and Ford have all expressed their support for her, and I mean, even if we don't like Donald Trump, we can at least like one of his picks, right? I mean, she's like the only one of these clowns that's actually worked in government before, and she's not the CEO of an oil company or Ben Carson. So yes, I'm sure there will be some negatives to Elaine Chao, but if you want autonomous vehicles as fast as possible, she's your girl. So Tesla and other car manufacturers like Toyota and Ford are all ready to incorporate as much autonomous driving capabilities as possible. But the real question is even if these cars can get from point A to point B, will they be allowed to? Government regulation of self-driving cars is likely something that will slow down the overall process of widespread implementation of level five autonomous vehicles. And while some like Elon Musk say this will be the year for autonomous vehicles, others such as the head of Toyota's research Research Institute Gil Pratt has said that it might be another decade before we see autonomous vehicle implementation. One major reason that Gil is predicting it will take up to a decade before level 5 autonomy is implemented is because humans really don't have much sympathy for errors when it comes to machines. And this is a major point because even though autonomous vehicles would be safer, there still would be some human fatalities in the early days and people would be much less tolerant of death by machine than by another human. Human. While 2017 might be the year that we are able to achieve level 5 autonomy, it might not be the year that we are legally allowed to use it. But with Elaine Chao as the head of transportation, things could go the other way, and we could see widespread implementation this year. There is still public opposition to autonomous vehicles, and even though these cars might cause some fatalities, it is still much safer than letting any 16-year-old drive. So what do you guys think? Is this really going to be the year that we see level 5 autonomy? Let me know in the comments down below, and don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next one.